the only thing I knew was the weight room thing stuff. So. I heard you hit 39 before in your past. Yeah, I got 39 <laughs> a couple summers ago, but you know it was it was all right. It wasn't too bad. 38. You dropped, I mean, you, you really honed down, haven't you? Yeah, yeah. I mean, I played the last year, my junior season. I was about 325 at the end of the season. So um, I got right now. I weighed in this morning about 314. You know, so yeah, I'll probably cut down a little bit. Um, you know, no no time really to rest. I mean, I got to start working out again, getting in better shape, like I said, so. Yeah. Thanks. Yeah, no Did you problem. ever have another test on your heart? Did you do that again with the 44%? Did mm -hmm. that ever get resolved? Or is that uh, yeah, when I got back, uh, I think the following week, I went up to the university hospital and got a second opinion, ran a CAT scan, eco uh, test, ecogram, uh, echogram. Um, did uh, the CAT scan, did the treadmill test, and they said everything looked fine, you know. Um, they said it might have been from a maybe a virus that I might have had from a cold or something earlier in the year, and now my heart's just slowly getting better from that. So they said my test that they had from here already looked better and showed improvement from what what they saw from the combine. So, so did they kind of tell you that, I mean, everything's fine then? Is it yeah, yeah, clear? everything's and, fine, yeah. And yep. uh, I imagine the NFL teams know that too? And it, you yeah. talk about individual workouts. Do you have a bunch of them planned? Or um, right now, just one um, so far with the Eagles, just individual drill, probably not for another two weeks, another week. So, you know, just got no time to rest. You know, this is uh, probably the biggest grind of, uh, <laughs> you know, getting to the, the draft, so, yeah. I think the most important time of your life right now. How, how you oh, yeah. Uh, you know, just like you said, this is probably the most important time um, of my career, for my career, and um, just got to take it a day at a time. Um, just got to work hard, um, keep on, uh, you know, hitting the gym, hitting everything, just like I said, just got to get in better shape. I feel pretty good, you know, with the drills and everything. I think I showed that I can move around very well for, for a big guy, you know, 315 pounds. So, um, yeah, I just got to get into a little bit better shape, and I think I'll be good. You going to go to the draft? Uh, I haven't decided yet. So, you know, it would be nice to take my family out to New York, but, uh, you know, waiting for that invitation. And if I get it, you know, we'll think about it and see what happens. You've been number one overall pick. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> we'll see. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see what happens. Because you today has been a great experience. How you? Yeah, yeah, it was real good. I mean, it was definitely good to see all my teammates again, and it's, uh, especially with the Krugers. You know, uh, it was definitely good to be out here with them again, see everybody, my family coming out and support, um, close friends and stuff. So it was definitely good. Where have you been doing your training? So you here in Utah. Yeah. yeah, I've been training in South Jordan, West Jordan. So. Cool. Cool. Thanks, Doc.